Welcome back, travelers. It's Slider, and we are back playing a little bit of Infinity Evolved. Yeah. As you can see, I got some shiny new armor, and that's because I have been working my Batania. And I got a little bit of mana built up and made myself some armor, as well as made this little guy right here, which is a band of mana, which basically, as I move around stuff like that, it stores up mana for me. And basically, my armor doesn't have durability, it just takes mana. Um, mana basically heals it so that's pretty cool but as you can see i've got some stuff done so let me get you caught up real quick because i did actually record an entire episode and it's gone now and i'll explain why but for that reason this one is probably going to go a little bit longer because there's some stuff i want to get done that i did kind of do in that other episode uh but i kind of wanted to actually like do it again if you know what i mean and so with that being said uh this one might be a little bit longer but I have moved my Emmy system and my little solar pounder setup or whatever. And I also moved my little house, little housey house is gone. And I'm starting to try to create a magical forest. Um, the long story short is this ugly, this pretty, ugly, pretty. So what I've been doing is chopping down silverwood trees, going over to some of the uh, silverwood forests or whatever, that's a magical forest, and trying to see if I can get some. I did find out, though, that only the ones that actually spawn with a node in them will actually convert the area. So a couple of these have actually started to convert them over to magical forests. However, the ones without nodes have done no such thing. So basically, I just have a lot of wood, right? Now, this over here is the farm. I got going with uh, forestry. And so I've been kind of playing with that a little bit. So I've got a little farm going on uh, right now. Not a lot of useful stuff for me. So I'm basically, I've kind of left it for like a day or two. Just kind of doing its own thing. And then we're actually going to go in the back door. I haven't finished uh, doing this or whatever, but here's my control area for the farm. And then this is where, where my house was. That little room right there is actually going to lead you down to here. But as you can see, I have not finished. It's all a work in progress. But here's some more of the forestry stuff. So I got the carpenter, the centrifuge, the squeezer, and the thermonic fabricator. And then over here is my new power station. So I'm not running solar anymore. I actually did the smallest reactor from big reactors. And basically, I'm just checking to make sure it's full. As you can see, it's been a while because it takes a long time to burn through that much fuel. So you can kind of see how long it's been since uh, the last episode. But basically, ME system is right here and uh, it actually runs out. I've got a line going into uh, what is now my Thomcraft building, where the stuff used to be. And yeah, and it's it, this is totally just a work in progress. As you can see, there's, I mean, I just see it as you can see, but yeah, it's a, it's a total work in progress. But uh, this actually leads back up to that little hut. It kind of looks like a greenhouse, actually. I got inspired by the greenhouse concept because I want to make a greenhouse because as I was messing around with forestry, I also ran into uh, some of the add-on stuff, and uh, one of them was uh, botany and making new pretty flowers and stuff like that. So so anyways, uh, in today's episode, what we're going to be doing is working on some Thomcraft. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, let me, let me show you this because we might come back and do a little witchery today. I'm not 100% sure. I, probably not, actually. So I was trying to build up witchery stuff. Hey, what, oh, I was like, you are there, okay. And so I was getting a couple items, right? Like I was getting some of the uh, Spanish moss and uh, I needed to get like, oh, what are they called? Uh, alder saplings. There doesn't seem to be any in here. They're in here somewhere. Anyways, I was getting fumes. I was starting to get my fumes on my little witches oven here. So I need to get the alder saplings and the uh, hawthorn saplings and the rowan saplings or whatever. And I got some glintweed. I was like, ah, cool. You know, we'll go ahead and do that. I know they light up an area and stuff. So I put a couple down and then they spread. So I was like, oh, okay. So then I put a couple. They just kind of went out of hand. This glintweed spreads like no other. But I'm thinking it's kind of at its max. I haven't seen any more in a while, but it's a lot. And then like, you know, this, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Don't do that. Don't do that. So these burning embers, I think they're called. Ember moss. Um, yeah, they they spread as well. I had one of those and they started to spread. So not quite as crazy as the glintweed, but whatever. So anyway, so we'll be getting back to witchery uh, really, really soon. But today I really want to focus on Thomcraft because I 
basically want to be able to kind of do Thomcraft, you know, on a moment's notice. And so I want to start bringing in nodes and moving them into the house, basically. And to do that, we need to do a node in a jar. And to do that, I need a wand with a lot of power. And so, I'll pull out my sleeping bag real quick. Um, which one can I do it on? I can do it on you. Yes, there we go. I always have to guess which one because all my stuff's like uneven. Uh, you just have to be on a flat block. Anyways, there we go. So I, long story short is we got some Thomcraft stuff we want to do today. And the first thing we're going to do is start making some Essentia or Essence. And I'm not exactly sure where I want to put it. Oh yeah, this is my Thomcraft building. I didn't even think about the fact that I hadn't come in here yet. So I've actually relocated my Thomcraft stuff and this little guy is kind of fun. Check this out. It just eats your stuff and then yeah, you just throw it at it. It's kind of cool. Ah, I, I've been having so much fun like finding these fun, goofy things. But anyways, we are going to be doing, um, getting some ascension here and I'm thinking we're just going to do it up there. I need to, oh, I need my book. I need my book, my bookie book. All right. So I'm Thomcraft, Thomonomicon. All right. So it should be on the right page. Okay. Yeah. So we need to make some node stabilizers, which are relatively cheap to make. It's just quartz, pissing, you know, whatever, and some viz. So I'm going to need quite a bit of viz, uh, to make a couple of those. But we're just trying to get one today. That's the goal, right? But I want to get a new wand. And so two things I need to do is make an obsidian wand core. Because apparently it holds more viz. <clears throat> and to do that, we have to do an infusion. And that's what I actually already started in the last episode. Was started to build the infusion. But the problem was, I didn't know about these things down here. You need a sentient to run them. And then my computer crashed because the power went out. And I lost the video. Whatever. That's where we're at right now. Um, so I lost the video, but, but I need to make some Essentia and to do that, we have to, oh, and I also need it cause I'm going to put on a Thaumium cap, right? And that needs a little bit of Essentia as well. So, um, what we want to do is make, where's he at is it in this? Hey, stop that. Uh, it's around here somewhere. Is it under alchemy? Yeah, there it is. Okay, so I need to make this guy first, which is the alchemic furnace, which is a crucible, a furnace, and then seven of these blocks. That I can do. So um, I need seven of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I need the crucible, which I've already made one. And I need a furnace. I have. Cool. And then let me grab my wand out here. Which one has more? Well, let me just use the little bit that's in this one right now. So you go there and it was a wand, a crucible and arcane furnace. All right, cool. And I got enough. So now we got the alchemical furnace, right? Then I need to make the next guy, not the crucible. Come on, this guy. Then I need to make well, I'm going to have to make a viz filter uh, because I need the filter to make this guy. So I'm going to need five iron ingots, uh, a gold ingot, a bucket, and this viz filter. And this viz filter was gold and a uh, log. So, okay. So let me grab just a couple of these. And then whatever iron I have in here, I'll just grab what I have. Whatever I have, don't need, I can just put back. But not being able to craft, I think there is a thought. Oh, you know what? Let me see if I can make that real quick. Um, I believe there is a terminal. Ha ha! Right there, it's it, it's right there. How do I how do I make it? Arcane crafting terminal. Um, is it in the book? Uh, energistics. Yes, this. Okay, I gotta do research for it. Okay, so I'll do that next time. Um, but now then I can actually not have to do it here and I can do it like over here. That'd be really, really cool. But anyways, um, I got the logs, I got the gold. I'm gonna need a bucket. So we've got that. That should be everything we need. So the first one was like this. No, no, it wasn't. That was for the other one. It's like, First, make the logs. There we go. Put the filter there. Gold like that. But I need more viz. Okay, not a problem. I'm getting viz. 
I've been struggling with it a little bit. Uh, I don't have a lot of places around here to get Viz, so we'll see. And then it was like this, right? Gold there, bucket there, filter there. All right, cool, 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 cool. So now we've got that set up. So what this thing is supposed to do, uh, what do I want to put you? <coughs> uh, it's all going to move eventually. Let's go ahead and put you down right, right here. Okay. And then I put you on top like that. <coughs> okay. So I've got a list of Essentia that I need. And uh, basically we're going to pipe out of this thing into some jars. So we got to make these jars. And if I remember correctly, it's panes like this and uh, slabs, I believe like this and then I make them over here so it's like this just I'm, I'm kind of guessing the recipe as I go I think no okay <laughs> gotta look it up um no alchemy it's gotta be here aha warded jars oh just one with seven planks okay cool pains I mean that's easy bink bink and then you two go like that and we need 10 of these total. So let me, let me see how much glass I have. I don't have a lot of glass. Oh, but I have more panes. That I can make two more with. The hardened glass isn't going to work. Let me see if the colored panes work. Let us see. They don't. Okay. So I got to go uh, make up some glass. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go make up some glass so I can make all these jars. And then we will be right back. I'm hoping I have enough glass now and I hope enough have a viz. That's my whole thing. I don't know how much all these take, but let's go ahead and see how many of these we can make. All right, go. Oh, it doesn't take much at all. Just a little bit. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So I can go ahead and put all this back now and here you go there and you go there and yeah. Now we need to make some pipes because well, we're going to need at least 10 pipes um, with levers. So what was the recipe for pipes? Essentia tubes. Okay. So it's these guys and I'll get eight with that. Uh, Quicksilver drop. Quicksilver is made from, oh, uh, I know I can smelt something. Okay, I can break down a shimmering leaf. How many do I have of those? I only have three. Oh, you know what? That should be enough. There we go. And then that breaks down into nine. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And what else did I need? <coughs> no, I need this. Um, two iron, glass, and a gold nugget. And I, Did I just break all my glass? No, I still have 10. Okay. Um, yeah. Oh, perfect. 10. Perfect. And then iron. I have 17. Oh, I need like three more ingots. Um, do I have anything in here? No. Okay. Well, let's see. It's you and you. You go there. You go there. What was that? Oh, okay. Um, iron transport pipes. And what was the last item? Oh, gold nuggets. We might be able to do this with a few just to start. I have three gold nuggets. I have 12 gold nuggets. Okay. Didn't even think about the fact that I had gold on me. 64 pipes. Not what I meant to do. Whoops. And I just used all my viz. Oh. Not what I meant to do. All right, well, let's try it out anyways. Uh, let's see. A lever. I want 10 of these, so. Oh, that's so saddening right there. So, so saddening. Oh, goodness gracious. That is not what I meant to do. Hey, where'd the rest of my pipes go? Or my essential tubes? 
I just did it. And I don't have the aux. Did I just? Oh, you know what? It glitched and said 64, but I didn't have enough Essentia to actually do 64. How much do I have in this wand? I only have 3.4. Okay, I'm going to have to go find a couple of uh, ore nodes and get the Essentia. Essentia, Essentia? Uh, let me grab my other wand and uh, make sure I have enough Essentia to do this or Essence. I don't know what it's called. Viz! That's, that's the word I'm looking for. It's Viz. So I'm going to go find some Viz and I will be right back. All right, guys. So we're just heading back right now. And I, let me tell you, finding these nodes and finding Viz is not the easiest thing. Now, I've done some venturing out around here or whatever, but look how far I had to travel in different directions trying to find Viz. Uh, I covered some, co covered some ground. All on foot. No flying. No no creative flight or anything like that. You know, I don't have that yet. I I, I might make the flying sigil, the air sigil for uh, uh, blood magic pretty soon. But, oh, that is some traveling. But the good thing is I got this one completely filled and then I got this one mostly filled. So we should be good. So let me go ahead and throw you in there first. And we were making these pipes, right? So it was... Um, no, it was iron, iron, quick silver. Oh, no, wait, hold on. God, what was the recipe? We were just doing this. Well, it's been a while now, but um, iron, gold. Okay, that's it. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Okay, so glass there. But fortunately, I now know that it makes eight per, so we're good there. There we go. Got those. Cool. Now, we need our 10 levers. Okay, that's fine. This one has plenty. Because this is how we're going to do our setup here. Hopefully this works. I, I'm i hoping. All right, so you go like that and like that. Oh, no, that just goes on the pipes directly. Okay, so... I need more pipes. Um, yeah, I just did these. I know the recipe now, and I'm going to get it right and not do that crazy thing I did a second ago. Good thing I didn't have the viz to do it. Like, that's... The... How... I just filled you up. Did it take that much to do those freaking valves? <sighs> All right, well, let's get six of these started. <laughs> let's 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 get the six started, and then from there, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect thing. Let's size the wall. Okay, cool. Then we put these valves on like this, and I believe it just yeah. Oh, that's kind of cool. All right, cool, cool, cool. And then we'll go ahead and put our six jars down here. And I believe, yeah, I got to turn them all off. They're all on right now. All right, cool. So now I have a list of items that I need to uh, start collecting. So the first one I'm going to grab is uh, mushrooms. Well, let me get some coal, too, because I'm going to have to burn some coal as well. Um, I'm going to need some coal. I'm going to need some dirt. I'm going to need some mushrooms. I'm going to need some silverwood logs. Let me get some more. I'm grabbing way more than what I need, but I'm just, you know, making sure I got the items. Um, 
Oh, and then sugarcane or feathers. You know, I gotta go grab sugarcane. I've got all the items, like, readily disposed. So, uh, you're on this side. Let me jump off this side. There we go. Still don't have a quick way down there, so. Hey. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Plant yourself. Yeah, I used to make some, like, huge sugarcane farms. Now, I try to keep it really modest, because let's be honest, it gets kind of tacky and kind of takes up the scenery, and that's not really what you want. Oh, by the way, those are my apiaries. I uh, Like I said, I started with forestry, and one of the things is the bees, so I've been working on the bees. If that's something you guys want to kind of look into, because it's taken me a while to kind of figure it out and see what I actually, you know, I'm supposed to be doing with it, let me know, and I will definitely, definitely uh, look into, uh, you know, doing that. But let's see, the first one is, well, let's go ahead and just get both of these. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Yeah, there we go. So now I've got potential in here. Oh, hey, I thought I closed all you guys. That's open. That's closed. How, how did you, how... That's closed. That's closed. I wish there was a way to see if these were closed or open. Okay, so what's going on here? I can't quite tell. That's closed. That's open. Hold on. I can't tell if they're closed or open right now. Okay, so everything... Sh okay, so they're all like the wrong way? I don't, no, they're going the wrong way. This is... Okay, you're filling, right? I saw that number go up. You got a whole bunch in there. There we go. Okay, so that's going... You're stored in here, right? Yeah, you're all stored in there. Should be faster than this. So what I'm going to do, because <laughs> we're not going to stand here and just stare at all this, uh, what we'll do is we'll let this go off camera until I get all the Essentia that we need. And then once we get all of that, then uh, we'll come back and actually, well, you know what? No, we can set it up right now. I guess that's totally possible. Although I'm still going to have to go get more viz, but... I wish I knew if there's a way to transfer viz from one wand to the other. Although I don't have any in that one either. But we need this, this, this. Um, uh, what's the name of that thing called? Um, you'd figure it'd be right here with these, but it's not. Where are you at? It's the top piece of the infusion thing. Oh, heck, let's look up the name. Come here. Wow, my inventory is all cluttered again. Okay, uh, infusion is under artifice, I think. Yeah, what's this thing called? The runic matrix, right, okay. So let's get that guy out. I have that guy, okay. Cool, and let's get this guy set up. So, I don't know if I'm gonna have enough room here. If I put the pedestals right there, space, okay, so it can go right here. All right, so let me get these guys. So, it'll be you, 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 and you like that, right? Yes, okay. Pedestal goes in the middle, and then I put these four like this, and then the runic matrix goes right there. I think that's right. I think that's how I saw the drawing. But the problem is I won't have enough viz to actually start this. Yeah, I need to go get more viz. That's just becoming a little bit frustrating. Um, <coughs> okay, now I can put you back down. So let's close you. We'll put you back down. Okay, we're gonna close you. 
And are you filling? Yes, yeah, you're filling now. Okay, cool, 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 cool. So I know there's filters and stuff you can use. I don't know exactly how it all works, but yeah. So I need to go get more viz to do this. Let me put the pedestals down like this. And yeah, and then uh, let me double check everything I'm gonna need to get this wand, because then I'll have like a really, really uh, a good wand. I'm hoping, I'm, I'm hoping. This one, yeah, I need Percantio, Tenebrae, and Terra, which I'm not getting from any of those right now. Interesting. Um, and then a Balance Shard and an Earth Shard. I think I made one of those already. And then for this guy, I'm going to need two sets of it. But this is the one that needs Ordo, Ignis, and Air. All right, it only needs like a little bit. So I'm not going to put nearly as much in next time. That's just That was just too much. So let's go one, two, three, four. Let's see how many I get from mushrooms while that's filling. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this all sorted out. I'm gonna go get my wand filled back up because oh, it's so annoying. The reason I want a good wand is because I wanna be able to get a node in a jar. And if you see right here, I've been saving places like three vises, four with aqua. Like I've been trying to track the vises as I was out running around or the nodes while I was running around because it'd be good places to go to get those nodes in a jar and then I can bring them back here. So anyways, we're going to wait for these like all to fill up and stuff like that. And once they're all filled up, then um, can I open you now? No, because yeah, the pressure's like that looks closed. I don't know. This thing is so confusing. Whoa, that sounded cool and scary at the same time. Like it was about to blow. Anyways, I'm going to get the Viz. I'm going to get all these set up and then we will come back and do our first infusion. So we will be right back. All right, guys. So we are back and I've got my wand filled and for me, what I ended up doing was waiting until it would like cap off. And then I would literally just right click with the jar in my hand and it would scoop it out of here. So that was cool. That, that worked or whatever. But I've got my wand filled now, and I believe I should have this set up right so I can go, yes, and it's good. Now, to make our core and to make our caps, hopefully it doesn't take much viz to start this thing, and it'll all just be based upon uh, the Essentia. And I don't know how close it has to be, but we'll see. So I know I'm going to need a piece of obsidian. <laughs> I happen to have one left. Nice. All right, cool. And then I'm going to need um, some shards. I think it's a Terra shard. Yep. And the balance shard. All right. I should be good and simple. So I'll put the Terra shard there. I'll put the balance shard there. I'll put the obsidian there. And then I need to see what Essentia I need, or whatever this stuff's called. I think it's Essentia. Essentia? Essentia. Uh, let's see. I need Percantio, Tenebrae, and Terra. Did I get enough Tenebrae? Oh, yeah. All right. So, Terra. And I kind of want to put both jars, but... Like... Yeah, I want to use up this extra jar. So, actually, I'm going to grab both. And then, hopefully, I can swap it out, like, in the middle. I don't know if that's going to be, like, an unstable thing to do, but whatever. All right, so it was... Hey, you, then you, then you. Right, 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 right. And then I can just swap this out once it starts. Hopefully. So, let's go ahead and click here. Okay, so it's starting, and then we're just going to swap this one out. I just want to empty this jar. There we go. There we go. Did, oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. I was like, did it ruin it? No, 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 it's good. Okay. I'm sure there's ones where it takes like a whole bunch, so it would make sense. Okay, so then that's going in. Ooh, we got it. We got it, we got it, we got it. All right, cool. So that was actually a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. That's really, really cool. And I'm going to grab these other two and put them back down. And then for the 
Thaumium caps. We're going to need to do this twice. I need Ordo, Ignis, and Air. Uh, Air, Ignis, and Ordo. All right, cool. So, Air. We just get you out of the way. Oh, actually, I need you. Get you out of the way. All right, there we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, so Ignis and Ordo, and then the items that I place on top. Oh, oh, no, no, oh, no, 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 I wanna, it's these guys I gotta make. Oh, yeah, 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 okay, that's right, that's right. I need three of these, and these are made with balance shards in a cauldron. Okay, so I gotta get another cauldron. So we're gonna have to do this real quick. Iron, I'm gonna need the cauldron, like so. And then let me grab some nether rack. <coughs> so I can burn it and a flint and steel, like so. And what else did we need? Um, let me grab some something just to kind of make it look a little cleaner. Oh, eight, perfect. Um, do that, and shards, right? So I'm trying to make a balanced shard. So I need one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, right? And then I'll just pick another random one, whichever one, okay. So one, two, three. So it's five of these and a one shard gives you a balance shard. I think it'd just be random. It might have to be one of each. I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure that out in just a second. So let me go ahead. Don't like how cramped this is. Oh, wait, hold on. What am I doing? You need to stay there. All right. So let's just go ahead and break you like that. We'll put the nether rack right there. Ooh, right on top of wood. Probably not a good idea. And then go like this just to keep the fire contained and we will put our cauldron there like so and give it a tappy tap okay cool and I actually have my water sigil now so I can just use that to fill I believe I think I don't know for sure but I think yes okay cool 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 so let's go ahead and dump you and I should probably have started the fire. Yeah, no, that's only logical. All right, cool. And do that. And then you should start bubbling up. And then if that works. All right, so it's one, two, three, four, five. Oh, no. I need to grab the rest. Okay, apparently it's just kind of a mixture is what I'm getting, so. Uh, maybe I should just try to do one of each. Okay, so maybe that's what we'll do. Hey, give me that back. I was trying to do this. Um, where's the other one? There they are. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, like there's all sorts of stuff in there. Okay, that gave me a balance shard, okay. Um, I got Ignis, I have Air, I've got Terra. Um, what do you get? Okay, your Ordo, your Aqua, and then that should give me the balance shard. Okay, so. There's so much stuff in here right now. All right, cool, cool, cool. Now, um, what's the block of darker load? If I remember correctly, this releases some nasty stuff. So we want it to just kind of flow straight out. Oh, 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 hey, 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 hey. Hey, stop spreading around. Um. I don't know, can we do, can, is this cheating? 
<laughs> can we do this? Can we just cover it with blocks? Oh, it seemed to go away. Man, I can't place that block right to save my life. Okay. Oh my goodness. This block is like, uh-uh, you're not putting anything on top of me. There we go. I don't even know if this is actually doing anything, but I figured it's the safest way to do it, so safest thing to try. Now, if that stuff comes back, it comes back. Whatever. But let me go ahead and put you back in like that. Okay. So you're all done. Now, uh, we were just looking at it. These shards, I don't know if they just have to be smelted or if they have to... Oh yeah, just normal smelting. Cool. I can, oh no. <clears throat> Do I have a furnace? I don't have a furnace. Let's make one. Let us grab some coal and stuff. And then we can get this done. And then I'll be excited because we'll have a new wand that should be cool. Should be. I don't know if it is, but it should be cool. All right, so you go there, and then you get smelted. All right, not too long. And then those three along with the cap. Oh, darn it. I have to do both caps at the same. Ah, shoot. I'm not thinking right now. See, I have to do both of them, which means I need to get my shards back. All right, one, two, three, four, five, and then the sixth one, so. Two, three, four, five. Oops, the heck, gluttony. Six, okay, cool. Let's try this again. So, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, two. I'm getting a lot less, but one, two, three, four, five. And you know, I got so much of that in there. I'm going to grab a whole bunch of iron real quick just to use it. Because I know the iron uses uh, Percantio to make Thaumium. So might as well just do it. And yeah, that's it. So. I got three pieces of thomium. I don't know what uses those jewels, but it's okay. It's okay. So let's go back to the furnace and put you in there. And then we should be able to get the end caps. Oh, I know this has been a really, really long one guys. And uh, I don't know what to say. It, I had it, you know, an idea and I done some of the stuff already. And, but I guess some of it, maybe it seems a little bit longer because a lot of it I'm doing off camera. I've been recording for a really, really long time right now and I don't know where my actual time in the episode is, but I'm pretty sure we're at least half an hour. And I'm okay with going over half an hour for this one because this one's actually kind of cool and we're, we're getting a lot of cool new stuff done. So let me get rid of all this stuff. Let me empty out. Empty out my inventory. I don't need you right now. I don't need you right now. I think we're good. Um, I don't need you right now. Okay, so let's try to do this. All right, so one, two. Now I know this thing says, try to keep it as balanced as possible, but I really don't know what that means. Unless I put two on each side and I don't know. I don't know how you balance three. It just wouldn't make sense to me. So can I put both of you up there? Nope, just one at a time. Okay, it's okay. We've got our wandy wand. And go. What the? What the frick? Okay. Um, in an open area. Because apparently this stuff floats up. Like, I, I knew it floated up, but apparently it gets trapped. Um, did that take that one? Nope. Here, there's another one keeps knocking them off don't knock them off apparently this is like an unstable thing or whatever i know some say like have a stability rating hey now i'm taking damage 
Uh, moderate instability. Okay. I don't get it. It it has all of the essentia here. Why isn't it working? The other one went really fast. Ordo, Ignis, and Air. Oh, son of a gun. It's Potentia and Aurum. Oh, I even knew that. I knew that. Um, shoot. I knew that. That's why I had the Potentia, but I didn't make the Aurum. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. That's... That was a big old fail on my part. Let me get the Aurum. I knew I forgot to make something. Okay, so... You guys, we're back. And hope this works. I, it took me a while to figure out how to get Aurum because some of the like the wiki stuff's outdated. But apparently it's done with the Rethial Essence, which is what you get when you break nodes. And I think you get them from killing the Wisps, too. But uh, fortunately, my... Uh, what do you want to call it out there? My quarry has broken a couple nodes. And so I had some essence, a retheal essence, I guess it's called. And so, yeah, so I was able to uh, get a couple of those. So hopefully, hopefully this will go right this time. So there's one, there's two, there's three and go. And go. Am I like, out of essence? No. Why aren't you working? Oh, because I didn't put the cap on. Duh. And go. Okay. So yeah, you're going. Good, 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 good. And then you're going. Good. Oh, you're going already. Good. Okay. I think we, think we got a winner this time. I think we got a winner. Oh, yes. Okay. All right. Let's do this again. Oh, yeah, and I had to make another one. I don't know if I said that, but uh, I didn't. I realized that one of them got destroyed in the process. So I had to make another balance shard to make these guys. So, yeah, another hole in the roof. <laughs> Holes in the roof constantly. All right, hopefully I have enough. Yeah, it was only six, and I got eight in there. Okay, cool. All right. We're doing good things. I'm going to have to... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey. Um, where did you go? Did you... Do you no? No, no. Where did that balance shard go? That. Where did it go? Uh, I can't make another one this fast. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Hold on. Let me take the other two off so they don't break. So it doesn't blow those up. I'll take the chance of getting damaged or whatever in the process. Um, shards. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Oh, this is so annoying. One, two, three, four, five, six. Got you. Okay. And I could do some iron. Um, there's that. Let me go get another piece of iron. <laughs> Add on. Make as much thomium as I can. Okay. There we go. Got that. So I got most of it out. I just need to find something else to take those jewels. Um, and then we'll be good to go. But you're done. Okay, cool. Let's try this again. I'm going to switch sides. So one on this side where the essences are at. And you guys like that. Is it not working? Did it not? Oh, hey. Come on, this isn't fair. You already took the stuff. Oh, it's out of Potentia. Oh, which one was giving me the Potentia? Uh, which one was giving me the Potentia? No, I don't want that. Um, man, this is killing me. This is killing me. Okay, which one gave me Potentia? I forgot to record this. I was starting to do this in. Um, so I had to throw a punch of coal in here. Because that is what gave me my potentia. And... Where you at? There you are. Sweet. Uh, you. Okay, so start filling up. 
It's like six total is what I need. Five. Six. Go! There we go. <laughs> that was makeshift at best. But it worked. <laughs> Flux over here laying on the ground. But after throwing it all together, it worked. All right. And then I should just be able to craft you up, right? So you go there. You there and you there. Oh, and I'm going to need a whole bunch. And I don't have anywhere near enough. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to go hit up some <laughs> nodes. So I'm going to go hit up some nodes and get some enchanter, but, or viz, which is cool. Um, and then what I can do is, uh, come back and actually make the wand. And you know, this has already gone so long. I'm going to kind of review, uh, the vid and see if it's worthwhile to uh, go ahead and just go ahead and get the node while we're at it. Maybe make it like an hour long episode. So I'll kind of watch the editing and stuff like that and kind of make that decision. But right now for any, anyways, I am going to go get uh, the viz that I need. And then after we get the viz, I will uh, uh, come back, make the wand and we'll, we'll see. We'll see what's going on. So we'll be back. All right, guys. So we're back. I've got the viz and I've got the wand. It's only got a capacity of 75. I thought it was so much more than that. Well, the nice thing is it auto fills um, Terra. So if it's under 10%, I believe, it'll auto fill Terra. So uh, as long as it's under 7, I'll always have Terra on the wand. I thought it was so much more than that. But it's okay. It's a, it's a good start. Um, I can, now that I know I can do this stuff, which I got to figure out about all this flux stuff or whatever. But now that I know that I can actually do the, uh, do that stuff, then I, I can make, cause I know the great wand. Um, I was actually looking it up, um, right here. It's the, this one right here, it's Thami and boss silverwood wand. And that one it takes quite a bit more to make, as you can see. It's like 54 each. So I would have to make a wand to step up to it anyways. But this one takes 54 each. But this one holds up to 100 viz. So, and then this one right here with Tainted Ward goes to 150. So there's, a, oh, oh, creative only. I was like, wow, that's a lot. Um, so, I mean, I think we're doing pretty good. A chemically crowned blood wand. Interesting. I wonder if that's a thing with blood magic. Well, I mean, that would be, make sense, right? Uh, mana still inside with living wood. That's actually kind of cool. That's something I can look into. But anyways, the, the whole point of all this was that we were trying to get this wand because we want to go capture a node. Now, I'm not going to have a stable place to put it, but I do want to capture a node in this episode. Okay, I, I want to do that. Uh, we have spent so much time just trying to basically just get this wand. Now we've got a whole bunch of cool stuff set up and now I'm going to have to try to figure out how to automate this system because this thing was just killing me. But uh, we'll, we'll figure an automation out for that. And uh, this thing right here, I got to start learning what has what so it's a little safer to do and I don't get as much of that flux stuff. But whatever. We're going to go get a node. And getting a node is pretty easy. I just have to fill this wand up. But it's glass. And... Oh, I got to go make some more glass. It's glass and uh, some planks. And basically you build a jar, like a big glass jar around the node. And basically you just pick it up in a jar and then you right click it with the wand, I guess. And that's what I'm gonna need. That's why I needed a wand that had more viz in it because to do that, uh, let me get rid of some sand real quick. So I'm gonna get together everything we need, which shouldn't be much. It should only be, uh, what, nine, 17, I think it's 9, 9, and 18 plus 8 is 26. 26 pieces of glass. They take the potatoes out of there. Uh, 26 pieces of glass and three slabs. I'm oh, sorry, nine slabs. We wrap it up. We give it a little right click. And we're we're going to go do that. So I'm going to get all the glass. I'm going to go out to the node that I found that had four of the main elements in it. And then we're going to bring that one back. But I have to go fill my wand first. So that's going to take a little bit of time. So yeah, 
we're going to go fill the wand. We're going to go find that one because it's way out there and I still can't fly. So, um, in the meantime, you know what? We will, you know, I've just decided right now. Um, I watched the episode wasn't too long at this point. We are going to go ahead and just kind of turn this into an hour long episode. I just made the decision right now. Half an hour in or freaking almost 40 minutes in. It's going to be an hour long episode because I want to get my air sigil. <laughs> And I'm so close to having everything I need to uh, make the air sigil. That's what we're going to do. We're going to make the air sigil. So once I get enough glass, we'll go do that. And then I'll be able to fly over there, which will be so much faster. Because I've got the waypoint set. Um, there we go. That's good enough right now. I have the waypoint set. It's just it's so far out there. All right. So let us go ahead and turn this into regular glass. There we go. And then let me grab slabs. I, not slaps. Slap. Oh, of course I have eight. Of course. Uh, good grief. I just I can't get anything right today. There we go. There's the ninth. Okay. All right. So now we've got what we need to make of the jar. Now I just need to go fill this guy up. But first. But first. We're going to go make our uh blood magic second tier that's what i was trying to get to was uh we're gonna make the second tier uh blood magic altar that way i can make my air sigil and get around a whole lot faster okay i think we are oh six to two hundred okay so we've gone over awesome 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 so now we can throw our emerald in there and let that cook up i guess you call it cooking it looks like it's cooking. The little particles make me think of cooking. And then we'll have our apprentice orb because what we're looking for is to make this guy the air sigil. And that is one of these guys, which is uh, a blank slate, then made it. Oh, and a ghast here. I know I have one. I killed a ghast while I was in another. And then four eight, or six feathers. <gasps> no, why did I take that out? Oh. Okay, now I gotta donate more blood. Hopefully this will be enough. Hopefully, hopefully. Why did I right click on that stinking thing? Oh, goodness gracious. I can't believe I did that. Anyways, uh, so yeah, a gas tier, feathers. I know I don't have enough feathers. So while this is cooking up, I might actually run, go kill a couple chickens and get everything so we can craft that. So I'm gonna go do that because running around and doing all this stuff just isn't all that exciting. So we'll be right back. All right, so we've got, did I jump that far? We've got our ghast here. We've got our feathers. We have our, oh, I gotta have an empty hand. We have our orb. So let's do this. Orb, ghast here, feathers, and what was the other item? What was the other item? Oh, that guy. Oh, yeah. How much, how much blood do I have in here? <laughs> Not a lot. Okay. So, time to donate some more. Let's eat up. Let me see how much that was to make. I know these guys are like a thousand, so... Um, how much is it for this guy? 2,000. So I'm going to need 3,000 total. Okay. We're at 1,200. Oh, no, I don't need 3,000 because I already have the one. So I just need 2,000. So one, two, three, four. There we go. Cool, cool, cool. Let's do this. Let us do this. Oh, I'm so excited because I'll have my air sigil. And as a matter of fact, let me grab you real quick. I'm going to donate to my cause because I know flying costs and I need to put it in my system. While that's going, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. Yes, we have it. So it was in the middle and that there, we have our air sigil. Okay. Now, I don't have a lot of health and I think it's 50 per use. I think. And I don't have a lot in my system. I've got 500, so we'll, we'll see right now. So that was two uses. Yeah, it's 50 per use. 
but that's pretty cool. We've got our air sigil. So like if I want to go over to witchery really quick, one, two, three, four. Oh, awesome. 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 Up to the house. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I'm taking fall damage too, but it's okay. We've got the air sigil, so we can move around a whole lot quicker now. And now I have no life essence. Now, how much does it hurt if I do this? It should be, if one heart is 200, oh, probably half a heart. Let's see. It's doing a quarter heart. Okay. It actually is hurting a quarter heart. So, I mean, that's still 40 uses uh, on a, a full tank. That's... Okay, so now we have a way to get out there quickly. I've already filled up my wand. So what what the, what the frick are you? What are you? You make Enderman sounds, but you're not being hostile, as even if I'm looking at you. So that's okay. So what we'll go do is we will head out and try to collect this node and put a node in a jar. And hopefully good things will happen. So I'm going to go ahead and wait till I can fill up my, my life. Oh, you know what? I can just put my freaking orb in there. I didn't even think about that. Uh, I still got blood left in here too. So we're going to try to fill this up a little bit so I can fly around. And I don't know if I'll be able to like, you know, get really far, but whatever. It'll be quicker. Like I said, I have a saved point. So is this working? Yep. Oh no, I haven't assigned it to myself yet. Jeez. Come here. There. There you go. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So now I've got 215. Okay, cool. All right. So we're going to fly out. We're going to put a note in a jar. And then we're going to call it a day. Because I'm just really excited to actually start progressing. You know, once you get past all the grindy stuff and the basic stuff, you know, actually progressing with these things is a lot of fun. And then trying to catch the key, you know, moments and stuff like that on camera versus, you know, having too much fun and just kind of running away with stuff or whatever. Yeah, it kind of there's a balance you got to find that balance so anyways so i'm going to head out there and uh, well i'm going to save up some blood first and then we're going to head out there and i'm going to get a node in a jar so we will be right back okay so i just slept off the night and this is what i woke up to five freaking zombies mostly zombie villagers and then there's a skeleton over there too this was not a warm greeting i get a little bit of sleep try to avoid what the frick is up with you I, I don't know if there's a village around here. I don't remember seeing a village when I came over, but that was just crazy. That was just nuts. Absolutely nuts. Okay. Skelly? Yeah, you do this. Okay. Charge! Yes, I freaking hate skeletons, especially in the water. Like, they're so annoying. Ugh. Okay, come on. Come on. I'm trying... I am not going to deal with this skeleton while trying to get this freaking node. But anyways, I got all my um, my wands full filled, so that's a good thing. And I was debating on doing a second one, but then I didn't bring enough resources with me. I don't have enough planks. Oh, you know I can make planks, although I won't have the viz to do it. Shoot, yeah, because that one's got two of the elements, and it's a pretty strong one. And then this one has four of them. What well, one of them duplicate, but that would give me five of the elements. That would be freaking awesome. Then I would just have them. Okay, so can I? Yes, okay, you do work like that. Okay, cool. Um, let me build myself a little platform here. There we go. Okay, so if I read correctly, I'll... I thought I heard something. I don't know. All you have to do is basically create a jar around this bad boy. And then, well, okay. You just give it a clicky click with your mouse or with your, uh, your wand. Now, nothing ever goes as it's supposed to for me. So I don't have high hopes that this is going to work. Now I'm going to have to go read some stuff. But I'm trying to be optimistic. <laughs> and then I should just have to tap it with the wand. Shift. How? Okay, I know I read this right. I know I did. <sighs> uh, where is it in the jar? Just, okay. 
that's the the holder it's in this one basic info node in a jar haha <laughs> node in a jar okay so warded jars have proven themselves blah 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 i have all the essentia or all the viz it's nine eight and nine i did planks i did okay while trapping the node is kept okay um okay what is it saying uh, by constructing a large version of a jar around the node and acting the proper mystical formula with your wand, the node will become trapped inside the construct and will quickly shrink to a more manageable size. The jar can be easily uh, then safely picked up. Uh, the node is also frozen at the state in which it was trapped and will never again be able to recharge any viz it was missing. Okay. While trapped, the node is kept suspended and will not regenerate viz, nor can viz be drawn from it. It is possible to free the node from the jar by placing it in the world and clicking on it with the wand. Okay, so I uh, enacting the proper mystical formula with your wand. Okay, well, is it because you're connected? Does that have something to do with it? Okay, so I have at least seventy. Yes. Oh, there we go. Ooh, 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 I don't know what didn't do it the first time, but it sure did it that time. We have a node in a jar. That's pretty good, 30 of each. Except for the one has only 14, but whatever. If I had more viz, which I don't because I'm down to 15, um, put them together and I almost have enough. I I think this was pretty successful. I, I think this was a pretty successful outing. We now have a pretty cool wand. And I actually, is it F? Um, one of these buttons, not hats. One, one of these buttons, let me put the foci on this thing. Uh, controls, foam craft. Thought my tinkers, tinkers construct. Where's the actual thumb craft at? For the foci, for the foci. I thought it was F for foci. No, I've, I don't even know. I just wanted to do this. That's all. I wanted to do this with my new wand, but it's all good guys. I hope you enjoy it. And I hope this is more of what you guys want to see. Wow. There are a lot of freaking flowers over here. That is, that is a lot of flowers. There's something going on here. That's kind of special. But anyways, I hope you guys are enjoying it, And I hope this is more of what you guys do want to see. Um, if it is, let me know in the comments and let me know if there's anything you guys want me to, you know, focus on and take a look at because, you know, I am always down, you know, might as well fill up while I'm here. Um, I'm always down to check out new stuff. So let me know uh, down in the comments if there's uh, something else that you want me to check out because you think I would enjoy it or you would enjoy to see it. But guys, we are thawed out right now. We have our new wand. We now can do, um, uh, God, why can I never remember the word when I'm thinking of it? Infusions. We can now do infusions with Thomcraft and we now have the ability to bottle up Essentia so we can do those infusions. So we, we've come a long way and, and just a side note, because this episode was already getting long and I figured might as well finish it and get the note in the jar and we can fly, we can fly, we can fly, we can fly. And I think I used up most of my blood on my way over here. Oh yeah, I'm taking damage. Like, but it's kind of funny to do it this way. There we go. I'm like killing myself to do it, but that's kind of, that's a lot of ground to travel really quickly. So, so anyways, until next time guys, Y'all know the deal. I'm Slider Havoc, and I am out of here. Peace.